morning people. So I'm here at um, the Bangkok International Airport. Catch a flight down to Phuket. So it's really early in the morning. It's 5 a.m. in the morning. And as you can see, the airport is busy. 5 a.m. So, heading down to Phuket today. Didn't really have much sleep last night because I had to get up and you know, 4, 4 a.m. basically, you catch a cab down here to uh, to the airport, which is about 45, 40, 40 minutes from the city, something like that. Where do I go? Can you believe this? It's 5 a.m. in the morning, and it seems like it's like, you know, 2 p.m. or something. Okay, just in queue now. Go and um, check in. The airline I'm going is Vietjet. Never really heard of them before. I hope it's a good airline. Vietjet Airline. Maybe that's their Jetstar type airline here in this neck of the woods. Man, this airport doesn't sleep. I'm sure these people won't be near all night. I got here at 5 a.m. Place is chock a plot, packed. But you know, I know that before COVID, Bangkok Airport was like one of the busiest airports on the planet. So. Okay, now we're on our way, we just went through customs sort of thing and now we're going down to catch the plane, got some water. So this morning we're going out to Phuket. I haven't been to Phuket since 2019, so it'd be nice to be to get down there. But for now, we've got the long walk. Think about this airport, Bangkok Airport. You're walking for forever. You <laughs> gotta have good shoes. See, I'm lucky. I'm about that croc life. Look at this, the croc life, because they're so comfortable on your feet. So don't knock the crocs. What the croc is going on? Crocs is good for walking in airports. Okay. KFC. Thailand star. Woke up this morning. Got the cab around just after 4 a.m and got out, it was hot. It was probably like 23, 24 degrees New Zealand type of, you know, heat. It's really nice and warm. So, yeah. So put the hoodie away. The hoodie that I had when I came here was just for, was just for that long flight from Sydney to to here or you know New Zealand to Bangkok but uh, I tell you what if you guys are planning on traveling by buses in Thailand make sure you have a hoodie or a chamber because these guys love to crank up the aircon 
the aircon to below zero. Man, you know, it gets really cold. They love the aircon. Just like any 7-Eleven you go to here, the aircon is on like, man, like to freezing point. Like, you'd be like, did I just sit? Did I just see a pink one go past? That's how cold it gets. Hey. That's where I'm getting over there. We're going to B9. B9. Look at this place, see all the locals uh, oh, got breakfast, buffet over here. Got a little buffet for breakfast. B9, we're looking for gate B9. Well, early morning vlogs are always good to start the day. I think this is probably the earliest I've ever done a vlog. 5 a.m. in the morning. Okay, I think we're here. So busy here. Got a little fun seat now. Get our seat on. Some seats up here. Where was the same time last year? Yeah, where did we have the same time last year? Where? Oh, yeah, it was in Phuket as well. We had it in. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. yeah, central and uh, nice. yeah, but I only come for the one day. Do you want to say hello to my camera? So, uh, what, what's, what's up, brother? Up? Oh, where? What's Tell up, the people man? where you're from. Yeah, I'm from England. Uh, I'm here for Songkran. It is live, man. Yeah, look. It's, yeah, it it's is. It. Songkran is the yeah. place to be. And it's a lovely partner. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Yes. Welcome. Konjua. Konjua. Uh, Lisa. Oh, Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Yeah, hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nice. Yeah. It's one of those, we gotta go get the bus to get to the plane. Is that? I hope that's waterproof. Oh, it's waterproof. Yeah. Yeah. So, brother has been just telling me about the Sogran uh, festival and stuff. So, yeah, looking forward to it. So, what's up? I think a lot of these people are making the same trip to have the festival down in Phuket instead of Bangkok. That's how huge this airport is. You actually have to bus ride to uh, to get your flight at the airport.
looking plain. Okay, straight onto the plane. All fascist steps. Finally on the plane on the way down to Phuket. Looking forward to it. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's like smoke coming out of those windows. It's smoking. Yeah, yeah. It's smoking. What is that? What the hell going on here? Hey, okay. and I just met this lovely people from <coughs> From Canada. Hey there. Hello, hey there. Well, Filipino. Canada. Yeah, Filipino <laughs> to Canada. Yeah, and French Canadian from Quebec, actually. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Hello, this guy. <laughs> Same people we meet on the plane. But <laughs> we're watching the smoke. The smoke is coming out of the vendors. I know weed's been legalized here in Thailand. I wonder if the if the pilots, you know, probably getting ready for takeoff. What do you guys think? <laughs> Leave it down in the comments. Okay, let's go collect our bag down at the baggage area. So welcome to Phuket people, we're here now. <laughs> That's one thing I always notice when I'm in Thailand, these people love cranking up the aircon. It's a bit cold in here. Let's go. 
and the time is about 10 in the morning uh, Thailand time so it's like just after 10 just everybody yeah So here, so when you, when you guys arrive at the hey, airport, what goes about comes about. Oh, mate. my man, um, you're the man. Yeah, so yeah, you know. my brother, yeah, just offered uh, to share, go go on their ride. They're, he's got a car coming. The man. So brother, I just uh, met from London that I just met on the plane. Said they got a car coming, so I'm gonna go with the brother. Yeah. In the car, yeah. Yeah. Go back on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. So yes, and it's hot out here. Yeah, you know that. Yeah, thanks. You saved me a lot of trouble. I had to dodge all these guys. Oh, yeah. We're at the end. And we're lucky to get this. And it <laughs> looks run down as, you know. But it's pretty cheap and nasty. The reason why I just managed to get this is because it is so run. Thai New Year. All the hotels are booked out. The ones I usually stay at. It's all booked out. Couldn't get no hotel rooms anywhere else. So we're stuck here for now. Little fridge. Uh, got a locker. Blow dryer. That's the beard there. Got a bit of a balcony. And believe me, <laughs> these things here, they look better. They look better on the photos. All those look better on the photos. These old hotels.